trouble. Oh, 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 Why are you here? alone may prove too much for a day's work. Come back I'll another day, you. life taker! And bring a sturdy ship! <laughs> Don't hang around here! Go away! The clamor of hammers echoes out of the past. A great work was made. Gungnir, a gift from Loki for the Lord of Asgard, forged of sunlight and strong Asgardian metal. The spear was carved with runes to guide its path. Gumknir never missed its mark. Now Loki had the three gifts he needed to win his redemption in Asgard. Sif's hair, Gumknir, and Skithbladnir. But already in his mind a plan was hatching. Three gifts was not enough.
seen the city off from the vault around here before. Find it, and I may find the culprit. Amid all this excitement, I have had little time to dwell on Ragnarok. When will the storm break? Tomorrow? Or far in the future? I think the latter more likely. I have Loki in present for whatever role he has played in Baldur's predicament. His son, too, is bound by my chains. What of Sutter? The prophecies say he must play a part in Ragnarok. But for now, he's merely the abductor of my child, not the bringer of the twilight. Still, once Baldur is safe, I will return to Asgard and raise an army. Muspelheim must be conquered without mercy. <laughs>
the partial key I found fit here.
the vault was once here. Writings on the ritual. They are performed at night. There's emphasis on something called a salakar. My elven is rusty. Vessel of souls, I think. Is this the object from the vault? The culprit was deciphering elven runes. Something about the binding of only the most powerful hoogers. Searches for a Jotun and a Muspel subject to complete their work. Muspels killing Muspels. about the culprit's affairs. Only she and Sutra I wear. Marked here, along with a second location, another ritual site, perhaps. You're light on your feet, Asa. Following me now? You've become quite useful, Esir. My gratitude for opening the vault. Now tell me, what happened there? I'm following the stink as it rises. As are you. Care to tell me why that is? Days ago, Sinmara ordered my best warriors to the vault without bothering to inform me. I've not heard from them since. Well, you're casting your suspicions at the right people. Whose quarters are these? His name is Kaldir, an adept in magic. Or Seder, as you Asgardians sometimes call it. This place is where he practices it. Whatever he's doing, it is not Seder. At least not as I know it. He is using something called a Salakar. It is part of a deadly ritual. And from what this room tells me, the dead will continue to pile up. Dwarves. Yotna. Muspels. I don't know what you're talking about. You wouldn't. Your stepmother despises and distrusts you. Your father only the latter of those, for now. But in time, thanks to her venomous whispers, he may come to hate you as much as she does. This is a lie. All of it. Your twisted attempt to pit me against them. <laughs> Sift through the mess yourself. No other truth lies within. Where are you going? After the Salakar. Whatever it is, your father needs it. it Maybe the only leverage I have to get my son back.
Calder marked the place on the map surrounded by waters just northeast. If he's planning another ritual there, I may be able to understand what value this Salaka holds. It's not safe to be out here. Not safe? Why, this town is the jewel of Svartalfheim. There's nowhere safer, I assure you. No, I, I merely seek a toy my son dropped. But no matter, he has more than enough at home. And I must get back. My wife will be wondering where I got to. Come, walk with me a moment. I shall introduce you to my boy. He's always wanted to meet an Aesir. Now, I understand your concern. We too have heard the moose are coming. But I failed to see what they could want in Svartalfheim. But they are already here, close by even. That is why I urge you to find shelter. <laughs> you, Asir. I have heard how you are famed for your sense of humor. Tell me, have you met Thor? We are very close, yes. My son, he loves nothing more than hearing of Thor's adventures. Perhaps you could spare us a tale, if you have time. Let's keep moving. Oh, yes, of course. Where are your people? My people? Why, all around us. Probably looking at us from their windows. But pay them no heed. It's not every day an acid. What is it? Forgive me, I, I must have forgotten your name. Keep calling you Asir. Which feels quite rude of me. I have many names. My friends call me Javi. You may too. Oh, thank you. Javi. A fine name. Let's get you home. Hmm? Oh, yes, yes. Here, my home is this next one. I must ask, mind your step. <laughs> my wife only just potted the lovely plants this morning. And... Uh, and... Uh, do you... Do you see that? See what? M moose bells going into my home. No! What now? Now, where... Where is it? It. This toy hammer. Is this? Mjolnir, yes. My son's pride and joy. Tell me, have you met Thor? Um, as I said, we are very close, yes. My son, he loves nothing more than hearing of Thor's adventures. Perhaps, uh, perhaps you could spare us a tale, if you have time. He should... Uh, he should be here. Uh, any moment now, he should... Uh, be here. My friend, you must leave this place. It is not safe, and I think you may know that, yes? Not safe? Why, this town... This town... This town is the jewel of... Uh... Forgive me, my friend. I will not be able to stay any longer. Please pass on my regards to your wife and son. You're... leaving? Oh, but I'm sure there'll only be a moment. I must, uh, get back to my own son. I'm sorry. I understand. Of course. I, I hope you find that which you need. Find? Oh, yes. Uh, I was looking for something. Uh, I'm sure it'll turn up. Good luck to you. Huh? 
God's hero of the gym.
Any cost. Huh? Huh? Ah! That bird! 
birds. I should be cautious around here.
Tornado Opar came after him. Give me a hand with this. Feel great. Hi, Juan. It's Kara, isn't it? So you do remember. 
Why wouldn't I remember my own Valkyries? It has been many ages since Odin, son of Bor, father of Thor, took his duties seriously. Instead, he frets about the future, tries to wriggle free of fate. That's what I hear. Mind your words, girl. Whatever you say, my lord and master. Now, let's discuss your duties. This field of battle, does it bear fruit? The harvest proves underwhelming. Many have died, but without valor. <sighs> Unlike real heroes, they flaunt their wounds on their backsides, not their chests. What use will they be to me when Ragnarok finally comes? You have nothing to fear. I will make them ready for that final battle. Perhaps I can help. How? Why, let my own battle prowess serve to inspire them. You intend to tell them your old war stories? Ha! <laughs> Not even we Valkyries believe in those fantasies anymore. Then draw up an arena so that I, Harvey, Lord of Asgard, patron to all true heroes, may reenact my finest moments. Just the way they happened. This should be fun, if nothing else. So be it, lofty one, your arena awaits. Let me see what rewards I am fighting for here. Ah, the battle glory that has seen. Ha! <laughs> you can't afford it anyhow. Let me tell you a story. Let's see what embellishments you add to this one. I am looking forward to this. I will bear witness to your deeds in battle. Let me tell you of a glorious battle I had with the fire giants. We have the advantage!
I wiped the blood from my weapon. A group of Muspels took me by surprise. My tale, please you, Valkyrie. I have more where that came from. To relive such legendary battles pleases me greatly. Listen now to the tale of my first meeting with the Lord of Muspelheim. I'll finish you! With me, here! As I made my way onward, I saw Muspels lurking ahead of me. I attacked in a battle fury. A change of path. Interesting. Oh. Soon enough, I chanced upon a fearsome muspel, glowing with inner fire. You look cold, Harvey. Let me warm you up. 
Battle indeed, I think you'll agree. Well done, Harvey. Stirring tale. Remind me what I'm doing here. In this arena, you can spin your tall tales and fight your old foes, so as to help the Ain Harriar prepare for the great battle of Ragnarok. And, of course, for my own personal amusement. Let me tell you a story. Let's see what embellishments you add to this one. I am looking forward to this. Show me the blood, the chaos, the screams. Listen now to the tale of my first meeting with the Lord of Muspelheim. As I made my way onward, I saw Muspels lurking ahead of me. I attacked in a battle fury. Ah! 
much promise! Soon enough, I chanced upon a fearsome Muspel, glowing with inner fire. I'll have burnt crow for my dinner. Are you afraid, Lord of Frenzy? You must embrace the pain! <laughs> Battle indeed, I think you'll agree. The Scalds will sing this story through the ages! Hearken you to the tale of my deadly duel with two of the most feared warriors of Muspelheim.
take this! And so victory was mine, as it ever shall be. Mm, I feel stronger already. Hi, Juan. Over here. Let me see what rewards I am fighting for here. A boon to any warrior's arsenal. <laughs> you can't afford it anyhow. Farewell, Lord of Asgard. Thank you.